All right, I think we are good. Hello, hello everybody. My name is Nick Fox, and welcome. I guess welcome back to Super Mario Sunshine. I played this on stream a good maybe month, month and a half ago. And I didn't get super far in it. I started to do a YouTube series on it, and I wanted to stream today. And I didn't know what else to stream, so here we are. <laughs> Either way, the game's gonna get played, I guess, right? Um, couple of things I want to address before we get super into it. Ah, hold on. Fix my desk here a little bit. Eh. All right. So first off, uh, you see, I have a PNG tuber now. I am not normally a PNG tuber, but I. Uh, I, I don't know. I had to make some arrangements to my setup, and the arrangements that I made made it difficult to work a webcam, which is what works the tracking for my VTuber. So I switched to a PNG tuber just for. Is it going to be permanent? Probably. I don't know. It depends on how this new setup works. I just thought this would be something a little more comfortable. Uh, Lumpur, thank you for the follow. Welcome in, welcome in. How you doing? Much appreciated, thank you very much. Um, so we're gonna try it and see how it goes. These are not an official PNG tuber, these are just emotes that uh, you can use on my Twitch that I just uh, <laughs> put here for, for now's sake. Meow indeed. <laughs> or dare I say meowdy. <laughs> um, but I want—I just wanted to fix up my setup to be something a little more comfortable for me to sit in. And it, l literally, I have my game connected to my TV with my second monitor on a desk. So I'm watching OBS and chat on a second monitor that's on a table in front of me, while using my actual wall-mounted TV to play the game. <laughs> so I can't—I uh, can't actually use the webcam in this situation, unfortunately. I'll just click my... see where I'm at here. Yeah, I'll go back to Grunkle Hills. So we're, we're PNG tuber for now, and if I ever... If I decide I like this setup, which I'm already a lot more comfortable than I am at my desk, I get weirdly claustrophobic sitting at my desk. Because my desk is kind of in the corner of my room, and there's like a big shelf next to it. It's like a wall-mounted shelf, and yada yada yada. But anyway. <laughs> we're, we're just trying something new today. Anyway, hello everybody, welcome in. <laughs> I don't know how well streaming at 8 o'clock central time is going to do me, but screw it. I wanted to stream today. <laughs> Anybody who jumps in and follows me, um, I didn't stream yesterday because I haven't streamed on Tuesday and God knows how long. Um, I've been playing that Halo co-op for a while and Tuesday is usually the day we do that. And I still did it yesterday, I just didn't stream because I didn't have the setup ready and I didn't just want to freaking uh, basically go fetal in my chair at my desk like I usually have to do. Not out of... <laughs> I don't mean that out of like fear or claustrophobia or anything, it's just such a tight, a tight squeeze back there, you know? So now we're here. I asked, I asked Broken how he sets up the, the PNG tuber and we got it all set up and going. The only real issue that I could foresee with this setup is my microphone, because my microphone now is just a little bit further away from my face. I'm not I'm not right up on it like I used to be. So, because I, I don't like to sit up straight in my chair when I game. I'm going to be real. I don't like stripping over a keyboard. I don't like... Sitting up nice and tall at my desk, I know. Posture you're supposed to. No, I like kicking back in my chair and just hanging out and having fun. And that's one of the reasons why I don't stream as much, is because it's just so uncomfortable. <laughs> if you can believe it, it's just physically uncomfortable to, to sit like that. Do I need a new chair? Probably, but. <laughs> but with the through the power of perseverance and a crap load of HDMI cables. <laughs> we're here, and we're having fun. I'm gonna start off my, my little stream here by saying hello to Petey Piranha. And I don't know how long we're gonna we're gonna go today. A few hours at least, but I don't know how many levels we're gonna get done, I should say. Roar! 
I apologize if my PNG tuber is a little big. I'm just trying something right now. <laughs> Still getting used to the feel of it. No, that's not good. And we're fine. Nice, nice, indeed. At least I certainly like to think so. <laughs> well, you're talking about my problems. No, I'm about to give a uh, PD a few problems here. Smash. I will admit, though, it is so much easier to see my chat with this setup. <laughs> I don't have to, like, look over and hope to God I don't miss something in my chat. I have what is probably one of the most unconventional streamer setups of all time right now. And I am kind of digging it. <laughs> Nothing to it, nothing to it. And the first shine of the day. And for anyone curious, this is the, the GameCube version of Sunshine. This is not an emulator, this is not the 3D All-Stars version. I have 3D All-Stars, but I'm afraid to open it. <laughs> like, I have no reason to open it because I have Mario 64, Mario Sunshine, and Mario Galaxy in like their original forms. But like I have no reason to open it. <laughs> just sit up there and just let it appreciate in value, which I hate being a guy to do that, but I have I just I have no reason to open it. <laughs> Oh, if my if my GameCube disc ever breaks, then yeah, of course. But until such time as that happens, I don't know why I came over here. There was no reason for that. <laughs> I start talking, and then I lose track of what I'm doing. <laughs> Hillside Cave Secret. Well, let's go. <laughs> but while I while I'm thinking about this topic, I want to go ahead and say something. Um, I've considered. Um, doing VR chat streams. I've done them a couple of times. By a couple, I mean like literally two. Uh, Evie Boy 45, thank you for the follow. Thank you very much. Much appreciated. Um, but first and foremost, I do get motion sick in VR, so it's a little hard for me to do that. And it just requires so much extra setup with stream, and it keeps my PC likes to crash when it does that. <laughs> so. <laughs> Like, I don't have a problem running uh, VR chat by itself. You look so cute. Well, thank you! They are very cute stickers indeed. <laughs> well, a cute, a cute PNG tuber, I should say, at this point. But yes. Um, but aside from the motion sickness and like my computer crashing, it's just... I don't know. I don't like being that person and I'm not trying to call anybody out when I say this, but I don't like being that person who just does VR chat streams with, like, just a selfie cam on and just just reading chat. Like, I don't, I don't like that. I know that'll get me significantly more viewers, because I've seen people do it who have just started and <laughs> get, like, a crap ton more viewers than I do. I'm like, good, good on you, if that's what you like to do, but I'm just, that's not what I like to do. Uh, Ramon77VR, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated, welcome on in.
Now, granted, if I was not so prone to VR sickness and computer crashing, I would probably uh, do it more. But, alas. It's very silly. It is silly indeed, and I love him. <laughs> no, I know this isn't the way I'm supposed to get up here, but this is the way I have always gotten up here. How did you get a GameCube? Uh, I have had this GameCube for many years. <laughs> it is old as dirt. Actually, not my first GameCube. My first GameCube, I think it uh, got to the point where it was overheating, so I basically got to trash it, because I was a kid and I didn't know a thing about dusting my GameCubes. And this is like the second one I got. I got this one in like the late 2000s, early 2010s. The problem with old games, is what, like particularly Nintendo stuff, is that the consoles themselves aren't super expensive. I think the GameCube's like 50 bucks, so they're not super hard to find for a basic one that's not like the if it's like the Pokemon XD model yeah that's gonna run you a little bit more but like a basic GameCube you know but the games <laughs> the games are where the money is yeehaw I don't know how much GameCubes are there like 50 60 bucks something like that oh no my jetpack how dare You know, I was just thinking to myself, let's not get crazy. Let's take this nice and slow so I don't die and look like a dummy. But now I died and I look like a dummy, so. I got my face. <laughs> I need, I need to get used to this new setup though, because I'm having a tendency to like... I want to look at my OBS so I can watch my VTuber. Because I like him. He's cute. And uh... <laughs> I don't, my OBS is like... A quarter of my screen right now because of all the windows I have open. I have my TV on the wall that's just like the whole thing. And I'm like, no, I have to look at the, the silly fox sticker go bleh. <laughs> Well, we did the thing. Second try is to start. Let's start. Uh, Boxy Mason, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. Welcome in, welcome in. Okay, we're gonna go back and we're gonna do that again. I played VR chat last night and everywhere I went I saw a weird animal thing. Well, it's, it's VR chat. You're bound to see a lot of weird stuff. <laughs> that just sounds like VR chat. <laughs> Abwa. Why indeed? <laughs> now, if we go back and we do the secret again, there should be another shine for us to get in there. Ow. Pardon me. I'm not gonna make that. Oh, hush my mouth, I made it. Noise. Okay, so this time I'm not gonna lose my jetpack. And we got the red coins. Remember last time I did this, it took me a few tries, because I tried to be a little too showboaty. No, I, lo I love it when I press the climb up button and he jumps off. Thanks, Mario. <laughs> like, you could hear the sound effect of him doing the climb up, and he just fell off. Like, bruh. Ah, ah, ah. Oh. 
I kind of panicked. <laughs> Why is this harder with the jetpack? It shouldn't be harder with the jetpack. What's wrong with me? I've been playing this game since I was eight years old. What is wrong with me? I have 20 years experience in this game, dies. But not with that part, no. <laughs> I played Crawl Space 1 and 2 and now me scared. Now that was a result of me staring at my PNG tuber. I need to stop that. <laughs> I don't know what Crawl Space is. Is that like a VR chat game? I don't know a lot about VR chat games a lot on account of the motion sickness, so. Hey, focus, Nuke. You can do this. You've done this many times in the past. You are not dumb. You are a perfectly capable Foxo. No, 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 no. Not again. Right then. Well. Mario. Mario. QP and he is. He's taking all of my attention. He needs to stop that. Fancy tricks this time. Is my depth perception just going? These stars feel a lot further out than they used to be. There we go. Way bien. some of those lives I lost. And shine yet. Four tries later, but we got it. <laughs> nice. So the next one I think is the red coins. Red Coins of Windmill Village. But last time I played this level on stream, not only did I, like, take forever, but I spent the entire level just kind of, like... Uh... You know... Do you use Twitch? Yes, I am, in fact, live on Twitch right now simultaneously. It is, uh... Nuke underscore Fox. F-O-X-X. -X. Should be a link to it on my bio. You know, I was not uh, having the best day last time I played this level, we will say that. There we go. It's four. Do, 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 do. Hey, damn it. Come on, Mario, climb up there. There we go. Ow. Uh, let's see. There's number six. Oh, there was number six. <laughs> Smish. You are causing problems. You need to not be doing that. Hey, no, no, don't you defy me. Get back down here. Hi, 
Hey, what up? Forgot that bird did that. Ow! Alright, I know there's absolutely no reason for me to be attacking this bird, but I wanted to. I did it for me. <laughs> Need to find the rest of these coins. Ah, oh, they have it. Okay, right, it's the third time. There we go. Like a not done. There's one over there. See if we can find where this last one is. There it is. Cool. I want the sweat from your brow, Mario. It's only gonna get worse from here. <laughs> I wasn't even sure there was a blue coin there. I'm like, that looks suspicious. Well then. The wind itself is against me, it seems. Out of water. No, you missed me that time. Gotcha. Sun dried banana, indeed. Welcome, Minaretto. How you doing? are ever present. Wait a minute, hold on, I got an idea. I wish I had like a core memory unlocked, but I was thinking that there was a a mushroom back there. There was not though. I'm being a different uh a different mission. much of this as I can because we're gonna have to gonna have to use this space later TikTok keeps saying my connection is unstable I think that's cap I think TikTok is lying to me No pig things. I don't require your services quite at this moment. Please wait your turn. There we go. We'll call that. We'll call that usable. No. Mario. I guess you can't wall kick off that, can you? There we go. Hmm. 
No. I didn't have a witty epithet for that one, just no. Gunk. I know I don't have to clear off the gunk, it just makes life easier in the long run. Or to do a boss fight in a gunk soaked arena. Wakey wakey. Eggs and bakey. And here we go. Gotcha. Oh crap. Ah, okay. <laughs> Almost missed it. Almost missed my opportunity. I was expecting them to do a whirlwind thing. Oh, Petey Piranha, you're so gross and weird. Well, I needed that pig, and I killed him. I needed his service, and I killed him. Where did Petey Piranha go? He's over there. Why are you over there? Don't be over there. Get down here. Ah, uh, there's the whirlwind I was wondering about. Uh, morning, Gaming Welsh. How are you? Welcome in, welcome in. Just enjoying the room, nice. I'm currently engaged in epic combat with a giant flying piranha plant. Down here. I'll take those coins because I need them. Oh, that's not even fair. That's not even fair. I uh, love me a coffee. <laughs> nice. Okay, you need to come back down, all right, sir. Hopefully this time, I can stop you from vomiting again. Like a not idiot. Is that the Wii? Uh, this is the GameCube. This is Mario Sunshine. But yeast. It was playable on the Wii, though. <laughs> I feel all you know same <laughs> I got this game the year it came out for Christmas I know exactly how you feel <laughs> well not the not no not, not quite the year it came a couple years later was I around when it came out yes did I get it when it came out no I believe I was eight when I got this game <laughs> solid 20 years ago Yeesh. 
And we did the thing. Gotta check something real quick. Where's my... Oh, I forgot to set up my... Oopsie, hold on. Oh. 18... There it is. I forgot to set up my TikTok chat. For... To go on screen. So everyone can see it. There it is. Okay. I'm going to move this out just a little bit. There we go. Cool. Everything's good. Okay. That's a new feature that I only recently started using and I forgot to use it. I'm just playing the Wii after school with my brother. Shame to change taste in games. Yeah. Yeah. I used to come home, and the two games that I would play, like, more than anything else on the Wii were, uh... Mario Kart Wii and, uh, Monster Hunter Try. I miss those days. I miss... I miss the hub for Monster Hunter Try, but what do you do? <laughs> yeah, time? Yeah. <laughs> Find out what secrets the lake is holding for us. Yeah, it's one of those Sonic games, some of the Mario Kart games, yeah. Well, Mario Kart, like, GameCube, 64, Wii, Mario Karts were all absolutely based. Mario Kart 8, Mario Kart 8's good. I used to not really care for it. I like it more now, but I feel like the item system is just broken. It just, it just feels like... Like, I'm getting, like, you know, rather powerful items in, like, fourth place, and it just feels, you know, not quite there. But, you know, it's whatever. <laughs> the top tier childhood game, though? Facts. Indeed, facts. What was I doing? Okay, Dirty Lake. Right, got it. I am all over the place this morning, I swear. Hey, Silver, welcome in. Welcome in, thank you for the lurk. Much appreciated. Excuse me, Mr. Water Spider. How dare. Got a day off work and we're gonna see the new Bad Batch episodes. Alright, gaming. Thank you so much for stopping by, though. Much appreciated. Hope you have a great rest of your day. Let me grab this turbo nozzle. I'm shifting my chair a little bit. There you go. You got the turbo nozzle. Let us make you have a good one. Yep. We're gonna get the turbo nozzle and then immediately lose the jetpack. A lot of spinning in this one. Got it. Whoa! Got that one a little close. Whoa. Mario, don't do not do that. <laughs> you scare me when you do that, Mario. Uh, Vendor, hello, welcome in. 
Welcome, welcome. I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> I should not have done that. Right. I'm gonna pause for a quick second. I gotta do a thing right quick. Oh, really? Is that how this is? Well, putting that life there for that first series kind of doesn't mean much if I'm just gonna die in that first section there. There we go. Nice and easy. Is my depth perception off or something? Like, what is going on here? What is wrong with me? Do I need new glasses? I might need new glasses. Dang, blasted. Thank you for the follow. I don't know if it's just not giving the sound effect or if you did that when I wasn't here, but thank you. <laughs> Let me make sure my TikTok live is still working, actually. Hold on. Okay, it appears to still be working. Patience. Just be patient. Yeah, I'm not making that jump yet. There we go. Oh, I was going to say, did I just jump off the edge or something? <laughs> I was about to get upset with myself. Anyway, water. Let that gamer sub show. Okay, we're gonna do that one again. Well, actually, I'm gonna jump the gun and do Shadow Mario first, and then we're gonna go back and do that again. <laughs> Twenty. So that means we kind of unlocked we unlocked Nico Bay or Noki Bay now. Excuse me. We're not gonna do that yet, though. Go back and redo the secret of the lake. <laughs> Maybe we gotta do that other red coin mission. For a moment, I forgot there were eight missions and not, uh, not seven. <laughs> Technically, you only have to do the seven. 
You, gotta, you only have to do all the Shadow Mario missions to get to the final boss, but... For completion's sake. Let's take this one here. And away we go. See if I can make it in one in one lily pad. Oh god. Okay, that's gonna be a no. I don't know how I just did that, but I did that. Common thing when you watch me play games, it'll be like, how did you do that, Nick? I don't know. <laughs> but it's a thing I did. I am an enigma on the gaming world. <laughs> this is so much easier with the water pack. It's not even funny. And this P so far, this PNG tuber is much nicer. Like, I don't have to constantly reset my camera. It's not using up nearly as much of my GPU. It's cute. <laughs> like, it's pretty much everything I want. I'm not gonna lie. I like it. I approve. Hopefully this won't drop me into the abyss. Okay, we're good. Bada bing, bada boom. No, hit the hit the shine. The shine. There you go, Mario. Shine get. Yay. <laughs> So I'm going to get the, uh, this last eighth mission here. I don't, uh, I'm going to be honest with you guys. I don't feel like doing the hundred coin mission right now. So, uh, we'll handle, we'll handle that at a different, a different time. Bada bing, bada boom. Much indeedy do. <laughs> So I need the rocket nozzle for this one. Where does one find a rocket nozzle? Rhetorical question because I know exactly where it is. Oh, oh. Whee! Do I need the rocket nozzle for this or is it just going to make it? a different experience. I don't know, we'll use it. Why not? Right, that's one down. I guess if I fall off, it's easier to get back up with the rocket nozzle. That wind made me nervous, I'm not gonna lie. Good coin down there, we'll get that in a minute. Provided I remember to go down there and get that blue coin, we'll get that blue coin in a minute. Well, technically speaking, you don't even need the rocket nozzle for this. Ow. You know, it was either that or deal with the pokey, and I chose that. Way. 
Hello there. Get Ow. Get in my inventory, please. I must collect you. There you go. Not today. Try to take it easy so I don't fall off and have this take 15 attempts or so. Five. And we'll grab a blue coin, because why not? Okay, uh... Hmm. I'm afraid I don't quite know... There's one down there, I see it. Render distance on this game is not the best. <laughs> There's two red coins. And then one more, but let's get this... This blue coin here. Or forget about it. And just for fun of these, okay, I have 15 blue coins in this level. I don't know how many blue coins are in this level. I'm almost positive it's more than 15. Showing off the goods on that idol sticker. <laughs> Welcome in, Fluffy. How you doing? I'm mean, not on my ear. That my ear is full of radiation, much like the rest of me. Don't do that. It's not safe. Okay, so now we can go. There was a blue coin. Don't bonk me either! How dare! Uh... There's a blue coin somewhere that I remembered... ...needing to get. Let me see or something. Let me see- let me- let me- let me- let me try something here. Hold on. A fox. Fox indeed! Welcome in, Don. How are you? M. Foxo, yes. EP? I feel that. <laughs> okay, it's supposed to be a Yoshi in this level, but I think I have to do a, a certain mission in Peanut Park before I can get Yoshis. That's fine. That's fine, that's fine. We're gonna have to come back around here anyway. There's two foxes, yes. Well, there's... There, there's the there's the, sta there's the still fox and there's the talking fox. Oh, yeah, oh, no, there's you! You are also a fox, yes. You are the second fox of which you speak. Aha! The Foxos are everywhere. <laughs> okay, I'd say don't bonk me, but I kind of deserve that one. <laughs> okay. Nom pa bean, don't nom the beans! Not the beans! Those are the money makers! Please just stop by to say hey, well, hello! <laughs> I do appreciate you stopping by, much appreciate it. And if you are heading out, that's alright, just have yourself a good rest of your day, okay? Fluffy, stop bonking my chat! <laughs> you, I think, are probably a blue coin. Ow. Ow. I'm not good at dealing with pokies. There we go. Yeah!
And I'm out of water. Because of course I am. Okay, I'll just use the hover nozzle. We'll stop trying to be all fancy with it and we'll just go hover nozzle. I'm just gonna make it. Yeah, we got it. Nice. Okay, next I guess we'll do... We'll go ahead and do Peanut Park, because I know we're going to need the Yoshi in uh, Rico Harbor, so... Because the eighth mission in Rico Harbor is literally all about Yoshi. Hey, Tom, are you... Is TikTok's like, every time it says connection unstable, I'm noticing my viewers drop, like I just noticed that. I just happened to be looking. Is it kicking people off of my live when it does that? TikTok, how dare you? Stop it. Okay. And there's literally nothing I can do about it, but stop it. The Beach Cannon Secret. Another secret level. How much fun. Oh, this one we can get the 100 coins in now. This one's really easy. Easiest 100 coins in the game, if I do say so myself. Alright. Wow, you guys suck, don't you? but it was worth it. Oh, did you just lose tracking at that point? Come on now. Come on, give me another tracker. I <laughs> love the googly eyed bullet bills. They're so derpy. Uh, Spider MSY, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated, thank you very much. Welcome in, welcome in. I can get. Can, can I get. Well, not that. Not pain, that's not what I signed up for. There we go, that's what I wanted. Yeesh! Okay, you, with me. Blue coin, blue coin. Yes, indeed, Luma. Or Lumpur, sorry. I apologize to anybody if I mispronounce your name. My my, my eyes jumble up letters sometimes. I don't. I am not diagnosed dyslexic, but I do. I do get a little jumbly. I apologize. Now astigmatism. I've got enough astigmatism that makes optometrists go whoa. <laughs> Oh. This one's going to be the hard one.
guys. There we go. There's another blue coin over there. I see it, but there's one here in the here in the sand, I think. I don't know if it'll work on this stage though. Ow! I just turned and there it was. Alright. Now then. Now we can just do this for a little bit and get some coins. Also, Mr. Mole Cannoneer Man, your aim sucks. Like, I see why you need heat seeking bullets because you suck. I'm just gonna say it. But if you can give me another golden bullet, that would be nice. Speed up this process a little bit. No? I don't want to get too close to him because if you get too close, he stops throwing. He stops shooting bullets and starts throwing bombs at you, and the bombs don't get coins. Ah, there's a golden one. Nice. At 65, we're already most of the way there. I guess he's I got too close and he started throwing bombs at me. of the way there. This is a pretty easy 100 coin challenge, it's just a little... It is a little bit tedious, I will admit. Almost there. Yeah, I got too close again. Let's throw a pineapple at you in defiance. There we go. Bye bye. Wah. Back on in to go. Now we can do the actual secret. Ow. 
kind of hoping I'd slide around that, but this works too, I guess. <laughs> Bye bye. Well, he is just straight up not of this earth anymore, is he? Oh no, not again. However, would I have seen that coming? You continue to numb my ear, Fluffy. How dare. Oh shit. <laughs> I saw what was happening and I was like, huh, this might not be good. And, uh, it wasn't. <laughs> Uh, not with the noms. I am not nomable. I am radioactive. Radioactive material. Don't nom me. It is for your safety that you do not nom me. Ah. Boing. Boing. Ah! Cute bean. Well, yes, but that does not. That does not. That does not mean noms, though. <laughs> do 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 do. Nerr! Not the continuation of the noms. Alright, we got that shine. So now I gotta do that again. <laughs> At some point, you'd think Mario would just take a boat over there. Or like, swim. Like, enough with the cannons, man. <laughs> I would. Oh, I, w I wasn't paying attention. I accidentally started the pirate ships. Oops. Oh well. Game? Okay. I'll take that, didn't you? Go ahead and grab some of these blue coins just while we're here. I guess I can't wall kick off those, that's fine. Uh, ah. Wait, now, there's a way to a way to do this. I'm figuring out how to do this. I don't think I get a rocket nozzle on this level. I blast it. Wow! Good coin, why you no coin? There we go. Coin, I think, over here. Wee! That's a blue butterfly that requires a Yoshi, though. A Yoshi friend that I do not have. If you fucks, I hope you're having fun. Hello, Sleepy. Welcome in. I am indeed. How are you?
and goods. That's good. <laughs> Shmish. Okay. My angle's not right. Okay, no, no more of that. Let's see. I'm not gonna get all the blue coins in this level right now because I kind of just don't wanna. Probably a bad practice not to, but. Ow. There will be other opportunities, I'm sure. Okie dokie. Bye bye. Take this. Thank you. up here. Oh, this guy. Ooh, indeed. Cage. It's not difficult, but it's like it's weird. Okay, there's one coin left. Uh, where would it be? Let's check up here. Which has a vantage. Hmm. Yes. I've learned nothing. Cute bean, indeed I am. But not with box, though. Don't bonk me. How dare. I'm a cute bean, not a bonkable bean. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Take a second to we'll refill our water pack. Go. I'm not quite sure. Uh, I'm trying to remember the rest of the levels in this missions in this level. That's what I th next one I think is the one where we unlock Yoshi. There's Yoshi and then the Ferris wheel and then Yoshi go around. Okay. I had to think about it for a second. Really? Like Mario. <laughs> So I apologize in advance. If you've been here since the beginning of the stream, I've kind of... I've lost a little energy. <laughs> I'll be real, I was already t a little bit tired when I started. Running on not enough sleep 
exactly. But we shall persevere. Ugh, I mentioned that, then I start yawning. Off my chair. There we go. Ugh. Sorry, Toad. I didn't mean to do a sick trick off your head. Okay, well, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna do that beach cannon secret again before we do that. time I've had to do this level. Once for 100 coins, once for the actual level, and now once for that red coin bonus. Yeet. Yeet. And one more yeet for good measure. Oh. Ah. One sec. Okay, uh, so this is made a little bit more unsettling with the disappearing blocks and whatnot. Not more difficult, just more unsettling. Are these all, like, right around? No. I was gonna say, are these all here on these disappearing blocks, but some of them are up above. Easy peasy. <sighs> okay, now we do the Yoshima. You gotta save the sunflowers and get Yoshi's. I don't know why these turtles are Yoshi specific. I'm not complaining because it works, but whatevs. Smush. Loki, I don't know what fight you think you want to have, but you don't want to have it. This is probably one of the easiest shines in the entire game. Like this. There is no difficulty to this. Once you figure out like how to kill him, it's 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 over. Three down, two to go. Excuse me, sir. Do I do not have a minute to talk about my car's extended warranty? Get out of here. Poor 
I like tortoise. I don't. But <laughs> he doesn't even know that. Ow. But he was offended. How dare. Come, final turtle. Let us settle the score. Yeah. Uh, I mentioned being tired. No, I just keep yawning. <laughs> That's not good. Hey, what do you have to say? Thanks for helping me, and maybe the Yoshis will come back, too. Yeah, I don't know why those turtles specifically drove off the Yoshis, but... Shine get. Oh lord, you got a Yoshi. <laughs> hey you, I would like to commandeer your Yoshi please. There you go. Yoshi require Blanana. So I obtain the Blanana. Mario, that was a piddly little throw and you know it. I know the banana is as big as you are, but come on. I knew she got them mad ups too. Hey look, a new level. Let us indulge, shall we? We'll go back to Peanut Park here in just a minute. Now let's check out Serena Beach. Serena Beach is a weird level because there's only like two missions that actually have goop. Everything else is just like a haunted hotel. What else do you have to say? Wonder if this fellow can truly make me happy. <laughs> Oof. What do you have to say about that? I must have the worst luck in the world. Looks like another night of camping on the beach. Oh yeah, because the hotel's closed. Well, with it not being existent. <laughs> I love how these two are yelling at this guy like there's something he can do about it. Like, bro, the hotel is gone. It does not exist on this plane of existence anymore. It is in another dimension of goop. But please tell me my nightmare is over. You can save me. I don't know why. You just look very capable. It all started around noon. This giant mantis-shaped thing showed up. It was paper-thin floating silhouette. It came and covered the hotel ground with electric goop. It sank in the middle of the hotel, sank in the group, and I got stuck cleaning it up. Hey, look, it's the mantle! Did Shadow Mario make that thing? Is that. Is he making all of these, like, enemies? Is that the power of that brush? It just makes. 
makes enemies. This is definitely a more interesting boss fight compared to everything else we've done so far at this point. It's actually a little bit difficult. But there is a strat to this. And the strat is to get everything down to the smallest unit. If you just try chasing them down all over the place, then it ain't gonna work. If you just get everything down to the smallest unit, they'll start chasing you. And then when they start chasing you, you can just kind of lure them over here. They, now they're all chasing me, and they're all just going to come to me. And they're not super fast, they're not particularly threatening. And it's better to be here than like running all over the place. Because there's just electric goop everywhere. Whereas I'm super low on water. Easy peasy, then it's really. At this point, I'm kind of having fun with it. I wonder how many of these things there are in total. You can probably do the math and figure it out, but... I are rather lazy. And the goop dries up and the hotel comes back. You know, for a resort, resort destination island, this is the only hotel, I think, and it's only like three floors. Like, what kind of super, like, I guess it's like a really exclusive resort, I don't know. But the hotel only has three floors. Whatever. Not my job to care. <laughs> Oh snap, I'm sitting here playing Mario Sunshine. There was another game I wanted to play that I saw a video on. And I meant to download it and I forgot. So, but we'll, we'll catch that next time. I just now randomly, ra now randomly remembered that. Do you think Shadow Mario would act actively attack me when these when these missions come up, like in the levels? He never attacks you. He just kind of runs around and runs away from you. Take that, thank you. Mario. 28 seems like a weird number to just get the turbo nozzle at, but I'm not complaining. Ah, oh, I thought I could make that jump. Hold on, I think I can make this jump. I want to try it one or two more times, but I'm not going to waste all heck of it. It's really hard to line up. I probably just need to hover and for this, though. Okay, that's not what I meant to do. I got it. Don't worry, guys, I got it. Line up the shot. But you try to correct just a tiny bit. There's no tiny bit of correction. You know what? Forget it. Forget it. We'll, we'll worry about that later. I have bigger fish to fry.
Okay, so there's another uh, turbo nozzle related shine. There's a couple of shines I think that I need to get with this thing. I don't know if I got the bird over here. We'll find out. Bruh! My life! I just decided I didn't want to be here! <laughs> I'm freaking... Just ran away, skimming across the water like some kind of Jesus mushroom. I have not gotten that shine, okay. Okay, I don't think I can get across that with the turbo nozzle. Uh, a better gamer than me probably could, but I could not do it, so... I'm gonna go get a hover. Always love the turbo nozzle, it was always my favorite. Makes me kind of sad they don't do more with it. Because I feel... It's just me personally, but I feel like the turbo nozzle in this game is pretty underutilized. Like with the rocket nozzle, it's like, yeah, it's the rocket nozzle, that's... It has its application. The turbo nozzle, though, is just kind of for funsies. Or so it would seem. This is where I get the rocket nozzle? Yep. <laughs> Good luck and everything all at once here. You there, come back. Stop, stop with the with the running and such. You're just gonna run across these three platforms here, aren't you? Hang blast it. I'm decent at video games, guys, I swear. <laughs> There you go. You mean a rocket nozzle? I really? I can't shoot you with water while you're in the water, sir. There we go. Now there's a lot of Rocket nozzle related shines for us to get. Get off the bell. It takes a lot of water to rinse this thing off. There we go. Pretty easy free shines. Not that it really matters anymore. Would you would you hit this point? Like we have the rocket nozzle. You should have like every level except uh, Corona Mountain and the airstrip unlocked. But you, I think I think you gotta beat the final boss to go back to the airstrip. Thank you. 
Opa! Ah, there we go, we got it. Alright, second bell, it is now your turn. Clean. Clean. There we go. Ah! Don't you ever hit the ground with your butt so hard the entire earth shakes around you? Yeah, I do that on the daily. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so there's still a couple more shines I want to get with the rocket, and then there's another one we gotta get with the turbo nozzle. Uh, Nader Melon, f uh, 41706. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in, welcome in. Yeah. Yay! That's what I'm talking about. Papa. Yahoo! So now I'm going to clean off the shine gate. That'll be another shine. We're just cleaning up the shines right now. Did I do... Oh god, I don't remember. I think I did the Pachinko game. I'm gonna assume I did, because I don't want to do it again. Wait, right, hold on. Before I do this first, let's clean it before we go up there to get the shine. There we go. There's a shine sprite hiding in the graffiti of the shine gate. Bada bing, bada bing. Thank you for the rose. Much appreciated. Thank you, thank you. Let me get this one. Oh, boy. There you go. TikTok live is starting to be a little bit silly. Alright. There we go. Okay, so that was all that. So where is my rocket nozzle? Rocket nozzle. Turbo nozzle. Ah, yeah. Sorry, I had to adjust something on the other monitor there. No, Glacian, thank you. You don't you don't have to keep sending me things, but I do I do appreciate it though. Thank you. I fell. 
I pressed the A button and instead of jumping, he fell. Mario. Mario. Mario, that was on you, Mario. How dare. Uh, I don't think I made that. Oh, I made that. Holy crap. It may have distracted Mario. <laughs> That's fine. We got there. We got there. It's all good. <laughs> we got there in the end. That's what counts. Alright. Back to Peanut Park we go. Rainbow charms? Four rainbow charms? Why, thank you! Giving me all this- all the gifts, you make me feel- Feel like I'm actually a decent streamer, thank you. <laughs> I do appreciate it. And I can actually- because of the way I'm set up now, I can actually see when people give me gifts and don't miss them <laughs> as much. That's another thing, I give credit where credit's due now. <laughs> the number of times it happened before, just because I didn't look over at my other monitor, I didn't see who was giving me gifts and I was missing it. Okay. I'm not gonna do this level the way it's intended, I'm just gonna do this level. supposed to climb the fence up the back of the ferris wheel but i said nah <laughs> While we're up here, we might as well get the get the blue coins. Okay, now we ride the Ferris wheel up to the tippy top. for the confetti. Perfectly timed confetti. The Yoshi Go Round secret. I know what the secret is, and it's a lot of jumping. Oh, 
Okay, we have to go find the Yoshi. I think the Yoshi wants a pineapple. Excuse me, clamshells. Got stuck on an invisible wall there. Ah. Ah. You deserve that. No, he wants a pear. Well, there's a pear right here. Wait. Yeet! Alright, so before we go on about our day, what with the whole sacrificing this Yoshi to the merry-go-round gods. There should be a blue butterfly. Yeah. And here we go. Do 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 do. See what I tell you. A lot of jumping. I may have jumped the gun a little bit. Got a little too overzealous there. Here we go. <laughs> I scared myself for a second there and I was like, oh, I'm not going to make that jump. That was, a, that was a close one indeed. I, I, felt, I felt it in the pit of my stomach and I'm like, well, I'm just dead now. But Mario came in with the clutch. And now we get to do that again. Fun times. Oh my goodness! Lucian with the 49 roses! Thank you! My goodness! I don't know why you think I deserve so many gifts, but thank you! <laughs> I do appreciate it! Like, honestly, wow! <laughs> That's a lot! You, sir, I don't like the cut of your jib. <laughs> Just give him a taste of his own medicine. I have spare coins. Ought to give it to you. Oh, thank you. I do appreciate being the recipient of your coinage. <laughs> ah! Mario, 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 you're sliding to the other side of the map, Mario. Stop doing that.
Become platform. Reject modernity. Become platform. Okay, so we've got one, two. Okay. Well, the platform moved out from underneath Mario's hands, and he just couldn't do it anymore. Mario! How could you do that? Oh, near! It's fine, we have, we have enough lives, we can keep trying. Well, this is a situation, isn't it? Ooh, ah. <laughs> I like to play with fire, as you can tell. Chat, chat, long time chat knows I like to play with fire. I see, I see, I see my goal. The path is clear. Well, it wasn't clear enough. I, I released the hover nozzle thinking there was a, a thing below me and there wasn't. Also, Glacian, thank you for the game controller. <laughs> Let's try this again with a little less a little less dumb. No, Mario. No, Mario. Come on now. Bonk. Now is not the time for bonks, Fluffy. How dare. How dare with the bonk. You dare bonk a radioactive flu such as myself? I died again. <laughs> <laughs> this is what happens when you bonk me. <laughs> Alright, we're enough messing around now. This is probably... This level doesn't... Yeah, this level really doesn't like me. Like, it's... Nice, calm, cool, and collected. I kind of wish more coins were on those, like, those moving blocks back there instead of in this juggle gem of blockage. But what do you do?
Yeah, see what, what I was doing wrong, and I will correct my course of action. It's fine. Bracelets. Are she on? You you are sending me like a Fort Knox worth of gifts right now. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what else to say other than thank you. But thank you. Just be you, Bean. That's all I ask for. I right, bet. <laughs> Alright, Shadow Mario, it is your turn. Gotcha. mission here. The roller coaster balloons. Some balloons. This mission kind of feels like, hey, remember that roller coaster mechanic you did in the first mission? But now you get to do that again. I'm like, uh, okay. Kind of nauseating, but sure. balloon before three laps. generous with the rockets. There is the first lap.
Ha! Huh. Double poppage. Alright, so we got two rows of three. Ah, I got two of them. See if I can get an angle on these three. That was not the angle. <laughs> Got it. Nice. That last shot was a wing and a prayer. <laughs> Hiding a shine sprite, by the way. Like these people know how important these shine sprites are, and so many of these citizens just hide them. on Rico Harbor next. It's weird because Rico Harbor is not that far from the plaza. So like, could just swim there. Pretty, pretty close. Adorable Bean, I am Fluffy Fox. Thank you for noticing. <laughs> Indeed. Meow. Great protogen, thank you for the follow. Welcome in, welcome in. Much appreciated. Welcome, welcome. I think we got a good time. And yeah, we did. Woo! Oh, a tenant, hello! <laughs> I didn't realize that was you who used the... <laughs> that was that perfectly... That was absolutely perfectly timed, tenant. <laughs> How's it going? I'm going good, Twist. How are you? Like, you could not have timed that better if you tried, tenant, I swear. <laughs> Y'all could have coordinated that and it wouldn't have been more perfect. <laughs> it wasn't even planned, I know. <laughs> I'm saying, had you planned it, you couldn't have been that perfect. Anywho. Welcome in, welcome in. <laughs> Also, I thought the hello sound effect was just... No, that was not. That's just a... 
an audio redeem on Twitch. No, like the little, like the the guitar was the audio alert sound with the follow and such. I know words. <laughs> uh, Hellcat seven one six, thank you for the follow. Welcome in, welcome in. Pop in and say hi for say after them. If you want to get on call the screen. Alright, well I appreciate you stopping by, Tenant. Thank you for your pop in. Hello, hello, and I hope you have a good rest of your day, okay? Easy peasy. I wonder something. There's two secret shines in every level. And if there's a secret level, it's always in a secret level. But there's only one secret level in Rico Harbor, and I don't remember where the second secret shine is. I think it has something to do with Blooper Surfing Safari. It's been many a year since I've, <laughs> I've gotten that shine sprite. Ain't no harm in looking, is there? <laughs> oh, you wanna go for a ride? Jump on the blooper you like best. I'm gonna super blue, so I'm gonna surprise. Okay, uh. I don't know, this is. I don't want this blooper. Uh, two lives left, so I can afford to... I can afford to take an L. Peak one's definitely faster, but it has crap for turning. Crap. Ah, I tried. Right, I'm just gonna go back to the yellow one and see if that does mean again. I don't know if you just have to beat this twice, or if I have to beat my previous time or something, I don't know. On these bloopers, the yellow one has kind of like a good balance of speed and handling. The green one's slow but turns better, and the pink one is uh, fast but it turns like crap. Slightly faster. Oh, yeah, there we go. Golden shine. So there is two shines in the blooper surfing one. Interesting, interesting. Boop! Ah, I've been booped! <laughs> How you doing, Moo? Welcome in. Welcome to the stream.
Doing good? That's good. Okay, Rico Tower. I take that, thank you. And there should be a one up over here. I am in desperate need of lives. I've only got like one left. There was no life in there. I feel like I've been lied to. Is it over here? Yeah, okay. wind attack me as I was going into the thing. I mean, I didn't lose any health, I guess, but come on. Here's a fun thought that I just... But my brain wanders when I game sometimes, and since I'm streaming, I might as well verbalize it. Um, <laughs> it's not that weird, I promise. Um, so, Nintendo recently announced a release date for the remake of Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Which, if you've never played Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door, it is one of, like... Ah, oh, dang it. It is one of, like... It's a, it's a very, very good RPG for the GameCube. And... I've seen a lot of people, not a lot, a lot of people, but enough for it to be odd playing the original Thousand Year Door on stream, which is awesome because it's hyping people up for the remake, but I'm like, just play the remake, guys. It comes out in like two months. <laughs> just play the remake. Hey, Zaldar, how's it going? Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Also, I will be playing the remake of Thousand Year Door. <laughs> I absolutely love the Thousand Year Doors, one of my favorite games of all time. I, I about flipped the lid when I saw they were remaking it. I was like, oh my god, the Thousand Year Door! It's a very good game. <laughs> and the only games left that like, have never been remade that me personally would like remakes of. And these are these are some weird choices, but all, all of the ones that other ones I would have had remakes of have been remade already. Uh, Donkey Kong 64, which will never happen because it was made by Rare, and Rare is owned by Microsoft now. But Donkey Kong is a Nintendo character, so that's a... That's a fun. <laughs> and then, uh, Skies of Arcadia, which... I don't know if Sega will ever remake Skies of Arcadia. I don't know why they wouldn't. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if the studio that made Skies of Arcadia is still around. Yeet! Yeet! Hey, Fizzy, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. But um, if you've never played Skies of Arcadia, it is like probably in my top three favorite games of all time. It is a fantastic RPG. And plus, once you get halfway through the game, you get a big flying battleship with a giant laser cannon on the front of it, and it is freaking amazing. Oh, I'm not using my VTuber today? No, so, um, to kind of go over what, what happened, I re reorganized my setup, and in reorganizing my setup, it's a lot harder for me to set up my webcam to use my VTuber, so I just went with a PNG tuber today. It's why I didn't stream yesterday. I was I was playing Halo with Broken yesterday, and he, he was streaming, but I didn't have my setup fixed yet. And it was kind of like a mess, so... 
I wasn't able to stream yesterday. Um, but I, I wanted to move my uh, ooh, I wanted to move my stuff around in a position that's a little more comfortable for me. And so far, I like it. And I like the PNG Jeeper too. It's definitely using up a lot less of my GPU. Like I don't feel because um, even when just playing GameCube games like through a capture card, I could feel my my um, excuse me my um, my computer pumping heat at me because like it no likey. Because VTubers are very uh, GPU intensive. <laughs> With the PNG tuber, it's going a lot easier on my computer. It's also making my room a lot more habitable. So all around... All, all around, this has so far just been a better setup. I do want to get an actual PNG tuber that, like, have the lip flaps and whatnot, but right now we're just, I'm just working with emotes. But I like it. It's a, it's a little more work to set up the, the setup. Because the way way I was before is I was just sitting at my computer desk like normal. But now I'm like I'm like turned. I'm not at my computer desk anymore. I'm facing my actual TV on the wall. And my game is uh broad is uh with an HDMI splitter, I got my game on the TV. And I got my monitor in front of me on this little table. And that's how I'm playing right now. And it's just because just sitting at the desk for too long just gets kind of claustrophobic for me. That and, like, the not... The not heat being produced by my VTuber is quite nice. <laughs> my, my bedroom has very awful insulation. And I can't just leave the door open because I have family and pets and stuff. It just becomes a whole cacophony in here. Plus, they don't want to hear me streaming across the house, so... Oh, yeah. Also, I'm pretty sure I've talked about this on stream before, but because I mentioned Skies of Arcadia, I have to mention it again. Oh, and before I say that, though, the one the one downside to this setup is I am a little bit further away from my microphone. But I have yet to have any complaints, and I did do a test uh, a test recording beforehand and it seems to be doing okay now tiktok might be a little bit different because i don't have the filters on tiktok because tiktok live doesn't let you do that because it's all dumb and whatnot <laughs> but it does uh that is the one downside but anyway the, my one fact about skies of arcadia that i didn't notice until a friend pointed it out to me um if you played or watched sonic boom if you look at Styx, Styx the Badger, like, her design is just straight up a character from Skies of Arcadia. And it makes me happy. It makes me very happy. Like, just, just, just this, other than the fact that she's a badger, straight up down to the character design, right down to the boomerang, she's a freaking character from Skies of Arcadia. And it brought, it brought Duke great joy when my friend told me that. Because IMO, Skies of Arcadia, is a game that deserves more love. Now, I don't, again, I don't know if the studio that makes Skies of Arcadia... Though it was published by Sega, but I don't know if the studio that made it is uh, still around. But I mean, Sega... I don't know if they own Atlas, but they do a lot of work with Atlas. And, you know, Atlas made a lot of good RPGs, like, you know, Persona. <laughs> So if they want to do a remake of Scares of Arcadia, I don't know what paperwork they'd have to do if the original um, creators aren't around anymore, just to get Atlas to do it. I think Atlas would do a pretty good job with it. A Atlas is not in the habit of making bad RPGs. Because, you know, Persona. <laughs> Ah. Sometimes you can get it, attack him before he hits you, but he's kind of being... Oh, come on, it takes a lot more effort this time to pick you out, doesn't it? 
Come here, you. Oh yeah, that takes a lot more stretchy. But that's okay. I like how when you first fight him, he falls into the goopy parts and you can't see him, like, not exist anymore. But the second time you fight him, he's like, yeah, you know, he doesn't explode or anything, he just ceases to exist. That's all that. Uh, before we continue, we're going to take a quick little bathroom break. Everybody get up, get some water, stretch your legs. I will be right back. I return. Back to the harbor I go. Water. <laughs> Here's a fun story about water. Um, I used to not drink water. I used to drink like exclusively sweet tea and soda. And if you've never had sweet tea, um, you usually go to like Walmart or any grocery store or whatever, and you can buy tea bags of what's called black tea. And I don't know. If, it depends on who you who you talk to and how it gets prepared. But like the way my house prepares it is you put put it you fill a tea kettle with water, and you put three tea bags in the kettle, boil it, and pour that into a gallon pitcher, and that'll fill about half the pitcher and fill the other half with water. And then you add like about a cup and a half of sugar. And uh that's a lot of sugar. <laughs> like and I, I was just, I've been drinking that and the soda a lot, and at one point I was just like, you know what, I need to, like, make a health decision. <laughs> and I cut, I cut that out, and I cut out a lot of, uh, a lot of soda as well. I died. And, uh, and after a while I went back, like, ah, I'm tired of water, I'll just, I'll get some tea. And, uh, I drank it, and I couldn't, I couldn't finish it. Like, listen, if you've never had, like, true southern sweet tea, it has... Like, if you're used to it, it's fine, but if you're not used to it, it has the consistency of syrup. Like, it is... <laughs> it is thick. It, it, it's... About the same as water as you're drinking it, but, like, it leaves behind... Like, a syrupy-ish residue in your esophagus. That's the best way I can describe it. I'm just like, bruh. Like, now I don't feel bad about cutting this stuff out. It's not good for you. I can guarantee you that, like, 100%. Like, I've lost... I haven't done many other changes to my diet, and I've actively lost a little weight since uh, I cut that crap out. That's just how much sugar was in it. And how much, that's how much of it I was drinking. Now, I'll still drink soda every now and again, but I don't drink it much. That's my just a little treat kind of... kind of beverage. But what I've um, been drinking, though, is I drink a lot of gamer subs. Poke to poppy. He. <laughs> um, and what gamer subs is, if you don't know what it is, it's just a drink mix. It's got like vitamins and stuff in it. There's no sugar. All sorts of fun. All sorts of funness. And um, it's like diabetic friendly, keto friendly, all that good stuff. And. Um, there's. There's a caffeine version. Like, it's supposed to be an energy drink, but there's, like, a non-caffeinated version, which is what I've been drinking. Because I don't know if I have, like, some form of ADHD or what, I'm not diagnosed with anything, but caffeine... ...makes me sad. Like, I, I can get a little peppy, but I'll end up eventually just getting, like, sad. Like, really depressed. And it, it, it hits hard when it hits, too. Like, oof. I know it's not always the caffeine, but the caffeine certainly doesn't help. Uh, I will say that I, I actively have been feeling physically and emotionally better since I stopped drinking so much caffeine. Box bean indeed, yes. Um, and of course, no, no discount to people who do drink caffeine, but I've also noticed that like 
I work a lot of night shift, and ever since I stopped drinking caffeine, weirdly enough, I don't crash as much on my night shifts. I used to crash, like, at least once a week on, on at work. And now I just, like, kind of don't anymore. I'll get a little sleepy, but not, like... I, like, crash out tired, like I used to. Like, you get, like, some non-caffeinated gamer subs. I'm not sponsored or anything, by the way. I don't think I'm sponsored. But... You get some non-caffeinated gamer stuff and some water, and it's just, it's basically just Kool-Aid at that point. There's no sugar in it either. It spit tastes better than sugar-free Kool-Aid probably does. And buy like a shaker from the website and everything. So, I like it. I'd, I'd been drinking the energy drink version for a while. When I cut caffeine out, I switched to non-caffeinated. And it's funny, when you drink the energy drink version, it tells you, uh... Don't drink more than, like, four scoops a day, because <laughs> there's that much caffeine in it. But there's no warning on the non-caffeinated version, so I can just sit here and drink my freaking Dragon Fruit Punch all day long. Just got back from playing an hour and a half VR session. Noise. Also, welcome back. <laughs> Oh, but yeah. That, that's that's how my life is going right now, that I... Just shilling out gamer subs without being sponsored. I can't tell what fruit that is that Yoshi wants from a distance. I'm assuming it's a Darien. It looks like a Darien. It's a Darien. But look. Not only was I right, it was the first thing that popped up. Def Durian. Yep. That sweet Durian, bro. Oh god, no! There she why? Well. That's, uh. That's unfortunate. <laughs> I didn't do that on purpose. It was funny, but I didn't do that on purpose. I gotta get another Durian, hold on. That's a pair. That's a coconut. Durian is deaf to- oh, I, I, I've only heard the legends about Durians, I've never actually encountered one. Like, I used to work at a grocery store, I don't even think I ever sold them. I don't know if we carried them, but... Why do you have to want a durian? Ow! Oh, I am such a disappointment. Wah! I can hear the fruit disappearing by the second. So, uh, chat, how's it going? I'm probably gonna be here a while, so... How's your day? <laughs> I've eaten some. It tastes okay, but the smell it feels like a gas leak and hot garbage all at once. I've, yeah, I, I, the smell is what I've heard. Like, but that is just like, if. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna commit. I don't know what kind of thing I'm gonna commit, but I'm gonna commit something. I saved it. Okay. I gotta remember which, uh... Which fruit does what. Are you the sideways fruit, or are you the up uppies fruit? I want the uppies fruit. You're not the uppies fruit! I want the uppies fruit. 
So the different different colors of Yoshi do different things to the platforms. Like I think uh, pur purple makes it go side to side, orange or pink makes it go up, and the other one makes it just be a static platform. Yoshi, don't don't fall off this, please. I think pink is up, but we're about to find out, I suppose. Uppies? Uppies. Oh, nope, I did not time that right. I blast it. Okay. I don't like this mission. This mission, this mission's kind of poop. Maybe I need, maybe I do need the purple platform because I've, I've done this with the pink platform every single time. So it is a bit of a bear. I got this chat, don't worry. I have never not got this. It's just it just takes me more a little bit more effort sometimes. I'm competent, I swear. <laughs> Almost did make that. Okay. If I can... Hmm. Okay, so, so this isn't... They've thought, they've thought of this type of cheese. They've considered this. Or have they? Okay. So now I'm gonna try to get up there with Yoshi. But I think... If I can just get the rocket nozzle, if I fail it again, I can just get up there. Uh. Alright. I did the thing. Yippies. And that'll do us for Rico Harbor for now. Now on to Gelato Beach. Oh god, Gelato Beach. That's where the sandbird is. Oh no. <laughs> I mean, the sandbird's not that bad once you figure it out, but it's just like figuring it out. Now watch me die seven times on the sandbird. Calling it now. Yeah. <laughs> yes, there is a big wiggler on the top of your tower, sir. What would you like me to do about that?
One more thing, curled up on the tower to take a nap. It's gonna endanger the legendary. Why do you have a bird that is made entirely of sand? How does it exist? Like, explain your sand bird to me, sir. It is a bird made of sand. No blood, no organs. Just, just sand. But what, what, what magical abomination are you planning on unleashing on the world, sir? Well, <laughs> the music started and Mario was just like, no, nah, I don't want to be here. Let's try that again. I think I need new glasses. My death perception is killing me. One down, two more to go. Mario. I think we'll do this. Boing. What's up, nerds? And double kill. Mario. And you're done. Easy peasy. I didn't do it. And where did that shine go? I was not paying the least bit of attention. Oh, it's over there. Okay, cool. <laughs> I literally was not even looking at the... Well then. We hit that sweet 50. That 50, yo. <laughs> See, the plaza's already starting to look better. It's got some sunshine back, the shine gates got the graffiti off of it, the bells are ringing again. Oh, now we gotta fight the Wiggler, because he's all mad now. He's mad because I woke him up. I like how we fell to pieces, and now here he is all in one continuous... Continuous bean. Neat. But you didn't like that, did you? Maybe calm yourself. Nope, okay. Oh. Oh, dodged it, did you? Well, well, well.
I was gonna say, is he gonna avoid it again? Oh, he's all mad now. Hmm. Okay, that's a negatory on that one. Try this one. Oh, I didn't finish it. Crap. Okay, I think that one's correct. I just didn't feed it all the way. Wow, you are, you're dumb. Like, you, sir, are dumb. Oh. Oh, no. Kind of disturbing that he turns into sand, but you know what, we're... We're, uh... We're gonna pretend that we're okay with that. Do you guys have anything to say about that? Yes, your primary concern should be the Doom Buds. Shine get. I think the next one is the Sandbird. Is either the bird or the race? One or the other. Yeah, Sandbird. God, the Sandbird. The most infamous level in the entire game. Also, why did they contain the Sandbird in a tower like that? Like, why not put it somewhere where it could break out without causing massive collateral damage? Here we go. You know, somehow jumping into the eggshell teleports me to the bird. Pixel art abomination. <laughs> I fell. All right, let's try that again. Let's get the tail first, because the tail's gonna mess me up. Okay. I'm not gonna worry about the blue coin. Right now, I'm just kind of worried about finishing the level. Take that one up, thank you. I'm gonna get that one. Because why not? Nope. Oh, don't go without me, no! Oh, well, that sucks. <sighs> Bye. I got that free one up anyway, so. Here's what it is. You know what's funny? As, as infamously hard as this level is, this was not as hard for me 
personally as when you get to Corona Mountain and you have to like uh, steer the boat through the lava. Because I never figured out how to do that in Noki Bay because you didn't have to. So it, uh, <laughs> it was not a skill I had acquired. Okay, but we're pretty good now. We've got seven of eight coins. We just gotta. Oh, here, here comes the. Here it comes. Here comes the turn. The turnies. There we go. It's nice and gentle. It's not even the hardest part of this game. Like that's literally all I had to do. And whoa, broken. How was you? Welcome in, welcome in. That was a that was a bird. I thought that was like a one up with wings. I was like, what? Finally off work. Nice. Yeah, you had a long day, didn't you, bud? I just remember we were in, like, Discord VC, like, what, five, uh, six hours ago? <laughs> you were still at work? Anywho. Now this one should be the race. Yeah, Il Pientissimo. Ah, oh, you dweeb. Shall race to that flag. Well, let's do it, gamer. He's over 1,000 likes. Am I indeed? Oh boy, 1123. Hot dang. This is good. Thank you, everybody, for the likes. Much appreciated. <laughs> Well, I'd like to know what Il Piantissimo looks like under his mask. I've heard rumors he's supposed to be like a character from Zelda, but I don't know what character he's supposed to be, though. He's supposed to be like Tangle under that mask or something? No, you're not Tangle. You're not worthy of the name Tangle. Yahoo! Okay, the next one should be the red coins and the coral reef, which that one's... That one's pretty easy. Get some more water. Okay. Let's find us some red coins, shall we? There's a blue coin out there. I know there's a cheap cheap guarding it, but hey, blue coin. Nice.
But all the rest of these coins are going to be... I don't have any red coins yet, and why I'm saying all the rest, I've just gotten blue coins. There's one. Like, there's just two with the schools of fish, and then the rest of them are in, like, the coral. Uh, hi, Bentley, how's it going? Welcome in, welcome in. Send it my way back around. There it is. Nice. You followed? Well, thank you, Bentley. I appreciate that. Shine get. Okay, we've got two more left in this level. The Shadow Mart and there's the Watermelon Festival. The Watermelon Festival, I admit, the first time I played it, and even a few subsequent times after that, uh, <laughs> was kind of tough, but... As an adult, I think I can handle it. I think I got this. Hold on, blue coin. Important blue coin business. Okay. Got him. <laughs> Easy peasy. Ah, uh, Bentley, thank you for the Twitch follow! Thank you, thank you very much! Bentley from TikTok. Yes, hello. <laughs> hello from Twitch side. Okay, so now we got to find a big old watermelon, which I know exactly where it is. Found your Twitch. <laughs> I'm glad. I always... It, it always kind of makes me feel nice whenever someone follows me from, on Twitch from TikTok. Because they don't... They don't have to go through the effort, so I do, I do appreciate it. Broke my my melon. Well, that coin is non-existent anymore. Case. 
so. I don't know how I should be going about this. Let's go straight down. Dang damn it. Hmm. Okay, you know, maybe going straight down that way is the problem. Let's go this way. May not be the fastest way, but it's probably safer. Uh, Fizzle, hello, welcome, welcome in, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. Just trying to get this. Well, dang, blast it. <laughs> Frostbite, hello, welcome in, thank you for the follow. This watermelon is being rather perturbing. I, th I think I got the right idea. I think I just goofed it. Like I said, I know this is like kind of a long way around, but I, th I feel like it's a little bit safer. Maybe I'm wrong, but... This is the path I've chosen. Yeah, okay. Yeah, you can you can get out of here. Oh, come on! Okay, I need to better understand the mechanics of watermelon. Let's try this again. Let's give this another shot. Um. Well, uh, I took a detour and kind of ended up in the same place. So, you know, it's it all kind of came full circle. Okay, now we just gotta get it across the bridge here. No. There we go. There we go. Oh yeah. Uh, you made more fragments than you did juice, bro. So that is Gelato Beach done. We've also done Bianco Hills, Rico Harbor, and Peanut Park. We started Serena Beach. Uh, Nico... Keep saying Nico, but Noki Bay and Pianta Village are now available. We haven't been to them yet. But with all that, though, I think it's about time for me to go ahead and call this a stream. It has been a good one. Certainly has. We've got the new setup going. Uh, I, like it. I like this new way of, of streaming. It's... 
It's definitely a lot more comfortable for me, personally. <laughs> but, anywho. Over on TikTok, if you're on the TikTok side, thank y'all so much for watching. I'm going to go ahead and end the stream. Y'all have a great rest of your day. Thank you so much for turning out. I do appreciate it. Okay, and over on the Twitch side, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, links down below to all the other stuff that are somewhere. Uh, that's, my, that's my YouTube address. What am I doing? Um, <laughs> I'm gonna send you guys off on a raid. Or am I? Yeah, I'll go ahead and send you guys off on a raid. You guys go off, have some fun, have yourselves a good day, and I hope to see you all again. Uh, I should be streaming tomorrow afternoon. Should be streaming some Phasmophobia.